Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome, my name is Claire. I've got another unboxing video for you today and it's the mystery gift box. This is what it looks like. So if you don't know anything about the mystery gift box, I'll give you a quick lowdown about what it's all about. But if you've seen it all before and you're just curious to see the mystery gifts I've been sent, then I will add a timestamp down below in the comments so you're free to flick forward. So this box was kindly gifted to me in exchange for doing an unboxing on my channel. Now the company is family run and they're based in Milton Keynes and they launched their website in January 2018. Now on their website they offer subscription boxes and custom boxes, which I'll tell you all about. There's quite quite an extensive amount of information. I will add information in my description so if you click show more underneath this video that will bring up description and everything I've talked about in this video and links and they also have a discount for if you opt for a subscription box if it takes your fancy and that is subscription 10. Not affiliated to me but I'll pop that down below. If I can find other discounts for the custom boxes etc all that will be down there so you're welcome to take a look there. So the subscription boxes then they offer one for her and one for him. Now you've got the option to pay £30 a box or £50 a box and it's free shipping within the UK they do ship worldwide so for a 30 month subscription you can choose to have it monthly bi-monthly or quarterly for a 50 pound subscription you can opt to have it bi-monthly or quarterly and for both subscriptions you can choose to have all the items gift wrapped individually which are gorgeous which is what they've sent me here and that's an extra five pound on top of that and you can cancel any time so on to the custom boxes then they have got a huge list huge list they have over 600 product lines in stock and they work with over 40 suppliers from UK and Europe so they're constantly bringing in items and they try and get quite quirky quite new quite different items as well and all the boxes will have a retail value of higher than what you paid for what I really like about it as well that if you do receive a box and you're not happy with it they will offer you a refund so there's no risk which I think is brilliant really really good so with the custom boxes the aim is to take the stress out of gifting so say if you You've got an uncle or you've got a granddad or you've got a mother or a nan or a friend anyone <laughs> and you find that they've got everything or you're not really sure what to buy them then you're able to look on the website and see all the different boxes that you think would suit them now you can fill in a form to customize it further by saying the age and like their preferences and their likes and things like that that will help the mystery box team create a box specifically for that person all boxes on the website are aimed towards adults but they do have a selection of products for children eight years and above and if they if you're looking for a particular box to suit them they suggest you emailing them and filling out this form just as a customization form but specifically for a children's box so when they contacted me a little while ago asking if I'd be interested in boxing one of the boxes on my channel they asked me what type of box I would like so I had a look and there is tons to choose from and it took me quite a while you've got a father's day box a mother's day box you got a mystery box for her a mystery box for him a gender neutral box a unicorn corn box, a flamingo box, a harry potter box, a gin box, a cat box, a prosecco box, mum box, dad box, nan box, granddad box and a garden box and there's tons more. <laughs> so you can imagine there's loads there, there is absolutely loads there. So definitely something to suit everyone. So I went for the mystery box for her and this comes in different price ranges. It starts from 20 pound, then 30, 40, 50, 60, then you got 75 and 100 pound. So I've been sent the 40 pound mystery box for her, which is apparently the most popular box that they do and they've also wrapped it up as well so I could show you exactly what it looks like all wrapped up individually which is really nice. <laughs> so I think that's it as far as information goes anything I've missed out as I said I will link down below in the description so let's get on to open it up and show you what I got. It's all like tissue really soft gorgeous tissue and if I grab it <laughs> there's a gift attached to it hold on this is a bad idea hold on that's what it looks like there you can see so I've got quite a few how many have I got one two three four five six maybe six little prezies in there the packaging is absolutely stunning it's got the mystery gift box it's their own wrapping paper but it's so lovely it is so so nice and perfectly done as well I'm absolutely useless at um wrapping presents oh I like the idea of clear little sticky tabs instead of like messy cellar tape or something but no oh I haven't got a clue what it'll be something glittery what is this oh it's a hit it's um it's an eye mask by danielle creations soothing gel eye mask for warm or cool use oh my gosh that's pretty cool that is huge though for maybe if i hold it that way that is huge i suppose yeah 
it feels wrapped around your head maybe oh wow and it's all like gel you can see in there let me take it out hold on oh there Oh, it feels nice and cool actually. To use cold, place mask in the refrigerator for 10 to 20 minutes. To use warm, place mask in hot water for five minutes. Retain these instructions for future use. So I know, so that's the first item and I quite like that. Next we've got a little one or a flat one. It's like my birthday or Christmas. Oh, we got a face mask. Okay, this is by Natura Potato and Parsley. Oh my gosh, under eye mask, okay. Rejuvenates under eye and helps reduce dark shadows. Potato and parsley infused under eye mask. Three pairs in there. Now we've had this brand before. When I say we, I say me really, and any of you lot that get subscription boxes. Um, I don't know, I don't know, maybe, I can't remember who I've got it from now, but I've never had this one, but no, potato and parsley. Who would know, who would know? So this formula combines the natural brightening agent of potato to rejuvenate the under eye area and the calming properties of parsley to target puffiness and reduce the appearance of under eye shadow. I see, so no, so that's the second item there. I've got something here, I don't know what it is, I don't know what it is, okay. It is, it's like Christmas on my birthday or something. I'm so excited, really excited. Ooh, something with alcohol. Something with alcohol in it. Cocktail party bath melt collection. All right, contains individual gin and lime, strawberry daiquiri, mango mojito, and pina colada bath melts. Oh my gosh. Please do not disturb, it's got on the back there. You can cut out and put it on your bath. <laughs> But that's what it looks like there. Oh wow! What they look like then? How do I open it? Handmade in the Peak District in England. <gasps> oh my gosh! Look how gorgeous they are! Oh my word! Oh my word! I, I don't know, bath melts, I was just assuming they'd be like little soaps or something. But no, these are gorgeous and I'm not going to eat them this time. I'm, um, no, they are good enough to lick. They do look good enough to lick, but I'm not going to do it. I'm not because I know, unlike what I did in my previous video, I can't remember what video it was, Pink Parcel. No, 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 I'm not doing it this time. Look how gorgeous that is. That is super cute. So yeah, so we've got four of them. I love this. That's a lovely gift. That's my favorite item so far. So there's that. Then we've got another one here. I've got two more left. Ooh, what's this? Leonardo. Leonardo, is it? Leonardo Collection. But for this coffee, it's a fine china travel mug. Ooh, let's get this out here. Oh, wow, that is really pretty. That is really, really nice. It's like a blue marble. That is really nice. And it's got like a plastic lid on top then. But why am I sniffing a ceramic cup? I don't know. Who was that? Not suitable for dishwasher and microwave. It's like just a little sticky, like a little pad. Is that just to stop it? I don't know. From slipping? I don't know. Anyway, that's what that looks like there. But no, I don't own one of these. I own a lot of like um, milkshakes or um, protein shake type cups and things like that um, but not a coffee one like this so does it say the same all the way around yes it does so no I really like that I think that's lovely we've got a big one this is the biggest one it's quite light I haven't got a clue what it could be and now I'm stuck with um, wrapping on me sunny by sue okay Oh, rip it away then, rip it away What have we got? I still don't know. Japanese garden, oh my god. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. It's a Japanese garden gin glass. That is so, so pretty. Oh, look at that, if I get myself out of the picture. That is so pretty. Huge, huge glass. <laughs> Let's get it out. I love this, this is beautiful. That is so, so pretty. That is so pretty, isn't it? Sunny by Sue. And that's that there. But no, I love that. That is really nice. Massive, you can see how big it is compared to my head. <laughs> nice gin glass, I love gin. I do love gin. But I'm not, you know like people have their like specific drinks they like. 
are any of you like me not not general, not necessarily like anything going but i like prosecco i love gin i love wine i love white and red and rosé um lager cider i think that pretty much covers quite a lot i even like murphys and guinness <laughs> I do like that but um, there's nothing yeah shorts I used to like Jack Daniels um yeah I don't know I don't know I do like quite a bit so when I go to a bar it's not like oh I'll just have my usual it's like hmm what am I feeling today what do I want it's... anyway I'm blabbing now but yeah so I am chuffed to that really really happy with that I've got one last item I don't know what this is. Oh, oh it's popcorn and it's by Joe and Steph's. Oh my word. <gasps> They're going to be gone. They're um, Joe and Steph's Gourmet Popcorn Chef and Connoisseur Double Salted Caramel Gourmet Popcorn. A stunning contrast of double salt and sweet. Oh my gosh. We've had these. I think it's in Pink Parcel. I think we've had little sachets of them. And they are gorgeous. Really, really lovely. And, oh no. <laughs> They're mine. They're mine. <laughs> Look at all that buttery yumminess <laughs> or caramel I should say isn't it sort of caramel so those are all the items so I'm just gonna gather them all up and show you one by one of what we had first of all we had this eye mask by Danielle Creations turn it that way then we had a potato and parsley eye mask by Natura then we had the gorgeous bath melts by, I think the brand is Cocktail Party, I think. Then we had a ceramic coffee cup by Leonardo Collection. Then we had this gorgeous Japanese flower garden gin glass by Sunny by Sue. And lastly, some popcorn by Joe and Steph. So my personal thoughts on this is that it's a lovely box. All the items are really, really lovely. I was worried that I wouldn't receive things I like. And obviously my reviews, they're honest. They are going to be honest. If I didn't like something or if I thought, ah, uh, you know, this is something that I could buy in the 99p shop or something, then... I would say, I would say, obviously I'm not, as you know, if you've been following my channel, I'm not a slater. I am not like getting in there, like slating brands, products, whatever. I'm more diplomatic, but you do get to hear my honest thoughts and opinions. And if I'm not happy about something or if something doesn't feel right, then you will know about it. You will know. But honestly, this box is really lovely. If you are thinking about spending, say, 20, 30, 40 pound or more, because this box goes up to 100 pound, I got the 40 pound one. I think a mystery box for her is definitely something I'm going to be considering getting for my friends in the future, definitely, because it just takes out that sort of awkwardness of not knowing what to buy. And sometimes, you know, giving vouchers is good, but sometimes it's a little bit boring, isn't it? Having something like this to open up, and I was excited, open it up, you know, seeing the packaging and everything. It's just, oh, I loved it. Absolutely loved it. If someone was to send that to me, I'd be really chuffed, really, really chuffed. Even if there was one or two items that I didn't like, it's the overall thought of it, isn't it? I just think it's nice. I just think it's nice. As always, I'd love to know your thoughts. What do you think of this box? Have you ever ordered a box from them to give as a gift to someone or ordered their subscription box? I'd love to hear your thoughts on this box and what you've had and yeah, the type of things that you had as well, just as a comparison. I'd love to know. But if it, if you haven't received this box, is this a type of box or this concept, this idea, is this something that takes your fancy? I'd love to know as well. Or if you hate it, if you don't like it, please let me know because <laughs> we're all different and I'd just love to hear your different opinions opinions so yeah so i hope you enjoyed watching if you did it'd be lovely if you give me a big thumbs up and if you haven't done so already please subscribe to my channel for lots more videos to come so take care and i'll speak soon bye